Okay, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to add new horizontal and vertical constraints to points on a 2D sketch. So I already have this bracket created and based on design specs I needed this slot to be able to be adjustable in size based on the center of the mounting hole or the axle hole where this bracket's going to go. But as you can tell this drawing is already pretty busy when it comes to dimensions. So let's say we got a new constraint that just came in that told me that the center of these two edges of this slot, of this curved slot, always had to be vertical in relation to each other. Now, like I said, my design here is already pretty busy, and before we would have to add a horizontal dimension and a vertical dimension to this point and then match it for each center. But now there's a much easier way to do this, and over here we have point constraints, and you can choose vertical and select the two centers of these points and you'll notice it'll snap to position and now when I move my geometry both of these centers will stay vertical in relation to each other no matter where I throw this geometry and the same will work on the horizontal as well so that just made constraining this part a lot simpler and it also helped me avoid adding one more dimension on this busy screen